Hey, got a special video. It's Wednesday again, but this time it's special because it's the final video of the build. The build that I was making for the young man who asked for the robot. Do you guys remember that? That's today. But before we get to that, I wanted to say something to address um, the situation that's happened in Charlottesville, Virginia this past weekend uh, and all the events that have happened since then as well. Um, I've gotten to the point in life where I'm no longer surprised by hate. It still makes me angry. It still hurts. It makes me very sad. But I'm, I'm not surprised by it. In this position of being a, a youth pastor, I, I, I've come to see an opportunity for me to do something to show another way, another way of relating, another way of being, another way of living in these circumstances that we find ourselves in, where we don't have to fight to define a truth that exploits or oppresses or dehumanizes the person next to us, our neighbor, where we don't have to live lives at the expense of other people and do so in the name of truth and in the name of God. So, after the video, I'm going to play a song. And in that song, the artist Kanan, he says, How can we teach our kids to love when it's killing that they're memorizing? And I really like that. Because it makes me think about that question, how can we teach our kids to love? And I want you guys to think about that as well. Wherever you're at, in whatever position, whatever platform you have, I think there's something that we can do to show a better way. So would you join me in pondering that question? And let's try to do something about it. Enjoy the video. God bless. Rashad, you know why we're here. Why are we here? Because I haven't seen you in a long time. And, <laughs> yeah. And of course, it's toilet. Yeah, I got something for you. Right, it's a long time coming. You asked me like a month ago to make it for you. Yeah. And I did, and I made it. Right, And so I want to give it to you, of course. And I, I wanted to, to give you a message as well. Uh, I was going to write it down, but my handwriting's not so good. And I thought maybe it would mean more if I just told it to you, you know, a person and everything. So uh, I guess what I really want to tell you before I give it to you, that it's an excellent figure and it's awesome. In you. <laughs> okay, no, no, no. What I want to tell you is that it's, it is a cool figure and it's one of a kind. It's unique. So like nowhere else in the universe is this figure. This is the only one that's very unique, but it's not perfect, right? It's flawed. But what makes it special is that there's nothing else like it, right? And so I wanted to give this message to you that in the same kind of way, you're like that as well. You're uniquely made. There's nobody else, nothing else like you, just you being you is special just because you are you, right? There is no other Rashad. And you're not perfect, I'm not perfect, but that doesn't take away from the value, right? Of, of who you are and everything that you are. So I wanted to give you that with this message so that every time you look at this, you can appreciate it, but to know that you are appreciated as well and you're loved and you're special as well. So does that make sense? Does that, you know, kind of make sense? Okay. Another question I have for you is, why do you think I did this for you? Yeah, because I asked for it and uh, because I know you for a long time. Yeah, right. Because I care about you, right? We have a good relationship, right? And so I, I, I wanted to show you what is love, right? Mm -hmm. To sacrifice for somebody else. To do so, I didn't have to do it, but I want to, right? Because I've known you for a long time and I care about you, all right? And so I want to show you tangibly in the figure that you love by me of course but then also by God right and he does stuff for you every single day right uh, whether you know it or not but I want you to know that it's true and the reason that I am loving you is because I found out what love is from God 
So, all that to say, whatever, you know, cool. You're like, let me see my figure, man. You're talking a lot. <laughs> now, when you asked me to make it, remember what color you said? Yeah. What color? I said red. You said red, right? So, I sat down and thought of a nice, cool red color scheme. You know what? I'll let you take it. I'll let you take it. Go ahead. It's right there underneath the, uh, underneath the, uh, the dish towel. You can go ahead and lift it up. Just take it out. Awesome. You can take it out. Here, I'll hold it. Wow, this is awesome. <laughs> it's okay. Go ahead, you can pick it up. So, yeah, he comes with a lot. Cool. Guess what? That's not even it. <laughs> There's more stuff in here. I'll explain to you what all these are, but here it is. Your very own robot suit. I think it's called the camphor. Yeah, it's called the camphor. So, hope you like it. It came out real nice. Looks like Iron Man. Yeah, almost. <laughs> yeah, almost. All right, man. Enjoy it. All right. Thanks a lot. Mm -hmm. Thanks a lot for coming out. No problem. Appreciate it. That's it. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. <laughs> You're welcome. How can you teach your kids to love when it's killing their memorizing? Love when it's killing their memorizing. Oh, wow.